What's up everybody, this is Zips once again from Total Gaming Network and CS Nation, and today we're taking a look at CS Militia that was just added, well, maybe yesterday, probably by the time you're watching this, to Counter-Strike Global Offensive from Valve and Hidden Path Entertainment. One of the first things you'll obviously notice is that it's got a nice graphical overhaul, uh, even when compared to the CS Source version of the game. It's not quite as uh, colorful as the CS Source version. It's not quite as uh, bloomy either, which a lot of fans will probably appreciate. The general layout's the same. Walking over here towards the one sewer exit. We'll, we'll come back to that in a little bit. Walk around the backyard. Look at the chickens, and chicken's dead. Just going to continue on our way here. Into the back shed. There is a hostage here. We'll come back to him later as well. And we'll show you the new hostage mechanics, which are actually quite different than anything we've seen before in a Counter-Strike game. Going into the terrace spawn. Once again, general layout, still relatively the same. Going down to the side of the house. All these windows are barred up. Still shoot them, but it won't matter. Entering into the back door. Here's the lovely kitchen. Very spacious. Very devoid of, well, pretty much anything. Phone doesn't do anything. Laundry room. Can camp out in there, which I'm sure many terrace will. Into the garage. Nice car. Nice pickup truck, I think it is. Oh, this is not even a pickup truck. Well, it might be. I don't know. Whatever. Up, Going upstairs to the attic in the garage. Chair doesn't move. You can go out here onto the little ledge so you can uh, watch people coming up from the sewer. And I'll make the jump. And nope, not making it. Back in the yard. There's the silos. That's again, it's militia. You know what to expect. It's a great looking map. Uh, a few of the changes they made for uh, Global Offensive are, in my opinion, quite welcome. There's a lot more option here. And this is actually coming from the counter terrorist spawn now. We're going into the left barn area, like maybe think it is. There's a tractor in there. I'm thinking it's a barn. Whatever. Shoot out the top windows so you can see in. Obviously, the terrorists, if they're up there, can see out as well. But now we're going to go through the sewers. Going to go down. And we're going to make our way back to the counter terror spawn real quick to show you where that entrance is from there. And zooming along, zooming as long. 250% speed here because Static. screw editing too much. There's the first exit. And zooming along. Drink. <laughs> zooming along some more. And here's the shed. Now we're going to pick up the counter terrorist. Now this is different. They don't follow you. You have to hold down on them as if you were defusing a bomb as a counter terrorist. And you pick them up. And they're kind of draped over your shoulder. You can't really see it in first person, but third person you can see it. And obviously you can still use your weapons and everything. Terrace just hanging out at that door. Don't mind me. Just passing through. Now, you cannot get a second terrorist, but here's the thing. With the new changes, you only need to capture, or rescue rather, one hostage in order to win the round. That's it. On this map, there are only two hostages. I didn't check any of the other maps that usually have, like, four hostages. In this one, there's two. You only need to rescue one. And I believe that one rescue applies to every hostage rescue map. I do like this over here, too. You can just go up as a counter-terrorist if they're not watching. Up to the balcony. Zooming along. Zooming along to the rescue zone. And that's it. He's rescued. He's safe. His buddy, I don't know what's going to happen to him, but apparently he doesn't. he's not worthy of being rescued. Uh, another cool thing here, um, you can actually fall through parts of the roof here. You can shoot it, or you can just fall right through like I did, which I was a little surprised there. Just shoot him. And here's the, uh, the bathroom. It's been transformed a little bit. It's kind of like a locker room. You can shoot out this wall here. Yet again, another entrance or exit. Very, very cool. Can't open any of the lockers I tried. Can't turn on the shower. I also tried that. Sorry. But there's another part of the roof there, and this has been Militia. Uh, we really hope you enjoyed this quick look at CS Militia, just added Global Offensive tonight. As always, this has been Zips for TGN and CSN.